Hi, how was your day? It's me. I apologize for the interruption, but do you have a moment? Good morning. The chairman will be here tonight. We'll meet on the fourth floor as usual. That's all. Good, you're all here. Please, come in. Sorry to interrupt. You must be kidding. After running several tests, we've learned that he has more than adequate potential. I called this meeting so that I could introduce him, since he'll be joining our squad. But, but, Mr. Chairman, he's still in elementary school. Besides... Besides what? His ability is quite promising. With the proper training, he could be a big help. But is he okay with it? Actually, I asked to join. I believe I can be of some assistance. Now, I finally know why I was given this power. So, as you can see, it was his own decision. Nice to meet you all. 
I'll try not to get in anyone's way. Nice to meet you, too. Hey, don't worry, kid. We got your back. It may be hard at times, but stick with it. Yes, got it. This year's going fast. It's already second semester. Next year, I'll be a senior. <laughs> that girl, she's drawing again. You again. Um, well, uh, I mean, I'm surprised you remember me. Same here. Well, you kind of stand out in that dress. So, what are you drawing? Nothing. Why? Uh, no reason. I was just thinking, must be nice to have something you're really into. It's no big deal. I only draw because I like to. Oh, yeah? Still, I'd like to see it when you're done, okay? Greetings. Hello. I thought I'd remind you, the next full moon will be in one week. Are you ready? Only a few trials remain. So be careful. I look forward to seeing you again.
yellow. So, we meet again, huh? That's because you keep coming back. I'm Junpei. What's your name? You live around here? Fine, fine. Ignore me. I'm used to it. Uh, hey, wait! Your hand! What's with that cut? You're bleeding! What is it with you? Why don't you mind your own business? But you're bleeding for crying out loud. I, I think I got a hanky here. Give me your hand so I can tie this over the wound. Why are you in such a panic? Are you crazy? Anyone would freak out over this. You need to see a doctor. You want me to go with you? Uh, you're weird. Chidori. Uh -huh. That's my name. You asked, right, Junpei? I'm almost done with the picture. I doubt you'll understand it. But if you want to see it, then you know where to find me. Welcome back.
you're back. Perfect timing. Perfect timing? For what? Hey, Puka, is Igus ready? How does she look? This is how I look. Huh? Am I seeing things, or is she wearing a Gecko Con uniform? What's going on here? She said she wanted to go to school, so I said something to Mitsuru Senpai as a joke. But the chairman overheard and thought it was a good idea, so as of tomorrow, she'll be a junior. Seriously? He's down with that? He said something about studying her behavior in a social environment. Well, as far as I'm concerned, it's a great idea. Just look at how cute she is in that uniform. The camouflage Fuka-san has provided me with seems to be the appropriate size. It looks very natural on you. No one will suspect a thing. But why does he want you to go to school? It's not like there's anything special about it. With the commencement of the second semester, I intend to synchronize my schedule with the other members. If I were to remain here on standby, it could delay our deployment. Therefore, I request to accompany our squad leader. Delay our deployment? Won't you going to school create more problems? I will make any necessary adjustments as problems arise. Uh, yeah, you do that. He said, I want to go to school too. Sorry, Korochan. You have to stay here. Class, we have a new student who will be joining us. She just transferred here. Please, introduce yourself. My name is Igis. I am pleased to meet you all. Igis? What a strange name. I wonder if she was born overseas. Let's see. Anything else I should know? Hmm. Humanoid tactical weapon. What on earth? What? Clearly, that's a mistake. It just goes to show, you can't believe everything you read. You can say that again, Teach. Let's see, you can sit, um... Are there any open seats? Oh, that spot's open, right next to him. That one should be fine. Uh, Miss Toriyumi, that spot's already taken. He's just playing hooky. Which means he's not here. So it's free to be used, right? This spot will be perfect. My highest priority is to be with this person at all times. I guess. Is there a problem? Um, Yukari, why are you standing up? Um, I... Ugh. My, aren't we just full of drama today? Do me a favor and save the antics for after school. Eesh.
Ah, oh, there you are. There's something I have to do, and I want you to come with me. You're getting on my nerves. The situation has changed. Sorry, but this time, I'm not asking. What? This belongs to you. Ugh. We have a new enemy. They're Persona users, like us. Ugh. Yeah, so what? There's more. Ken Amada has joined our team. What the hell are you talking about? He has the potential, and Akutsuki-san is okayed it. He's now a Persona user. You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> Let me ask you one thing. Was it his decision to join Seas? Yeah, he volunteered. I see. <sighs> then count me in. So you're the one leading the operations now, huh? If you don't mind me asking, what exactly are you fighting for? Is that so? Well, you do your thing, I'll do mine. Is my room still vacant? Yeah. Sup, dude? This facility is very similar to a temple. It is a shrine. Now that I'm actually here, I sense mysterious presences. But they are markedly different than shadows. Well then, I shall first observe the local traditions and worship at the shrine. I have heard that the mysterious energy known as Divine Grace reflects 
the amount offered. In any event, I have finished presenting my offering. I wonder, this system of monetary offerings is very similar to that of the Wishing Fountain. There are many places in your world for supplicants to request good fortune. You live in a wondrous place. Could those paper strips tied there be... As I thought, they're paper fortunes. I've heard of this game, where people entrust their destiny to a slip of paper and exult in the risk. I see. There are many possible destinies written on them. Well then, I'd like to experiment with this for myself. Please wait here while I work on obtaining all of them. Excuse me, I've been curious ever since we arrived. But what are those things over there? If memory serves, these are a slide and a jungle gem. The inner self is exposed to any true god. Their magnanimity of spirit excuses all. And that being the case... one's way to the top before relaxing in luxury. This playground equipment teaches a profound lesson on the true way of the world. That was a lot of fun. Now, could you please instruct me in the use of this jungle gym? than our other excursions out. To be honest, I've wondered lately, is this world enjoyable to me, simply because of the novelty of the stimuli it presents? It could also be that I, well, perhaps I may, in truth, be enjoying our time together because we are together. In any event, I believe I'll open negotiations with my master to bring a horizontal bar into our room. I'd like to accompany you again sometime, if you wouldn't mind.
Hey.